Research complete. Hello friends, my name is Swati Kumar. Let's start a new topic about how we can control NEMA 17 stepper motor in live view. Okay, we have a controller that is A4988. Okay, now first I show you about uh, motor and driver. Driver. Okay, and you see this is our motor NEMA 17. You can easy to purchase. Have a four uh, output, four wire output, and uh, the rate is 700. Okay, you can easy to uh, purchase online. Okay, now. Uh, uh, this is our driver a4980 driver okay and have a heat sink also it's very important okay and uh, uh, first you need to purchase uh, these two instrument okay after that uh, come on this project okay now let's come on the programming uh, sorry first come on the wiring okay uh, this is the wiring diagram okay this is our controller this one is our arduino you know and this is the external supply and this is our motor okay now you see in the hardware uh, i have a 12 volt battery dc and this is our controller and uh, you see have a one capacitor also uh, arduino you know and this is our stepper motor okay have a four wire okay now i tell you about step to step how you can do a wiring okay now you see uh, first week uh, you have a, s a supply okay uh, you need a 12 volt like 8 volt to 35 volt dc supply okay now i have 12 volt battery okay now i have a two terminal one is uh, positive other is negative positive connect to the v mode okay same like this and ground to ground okay and uh, it's very important if you have a capacitor like 47 then well or you can use 47 to 100 micro farad capacitor okay and uh, connect to the parallel it's for uh, controlling the noise or the motor okay now uh, you see how motor and uh, the motor have a four terminal wire okay please ig uh, ignore this uh, color coding okay now i tell you and follow these steps for uh, motor wiring okay you see have a red motor means red wire of the motor you see red wire and this red wire connect to the a2 count means a2 controller and you see in the controller have uh, already specification about uh, you see a2 2a you need to connect this okay and then second is black motor wire means this one black wire you need to connect to the b1 of your controller b1 of your controller b1 means uh, like 1b okay you need to connect this okay then third wire is blue wire blue motor wire this one and you need to connect to the b2 of your controller and b2 means to be you need to connect here and the last one is green okay and you need to connect to the a1 of the controller okay a1 is means 1a okay okay after that it's a motor wiring is complete then next step is arduino you know arduino you know have a vdd and ground vd means 5 volt or a 3 to 5 volt okay and now i'm connected to the 5 volt to vdd and ground to ground okay after that have a we are using two pins now i am using p4 and p3 if you have you using other uh, wiring you can choose as per your comment okay now i am choosing p4 for direction dir means direction connect to pin number 4 of the arduino and step means step of the uh, your stepper motor okay you need to connect to the p number 3 okay it's very important for a uh, like a looping or we can say short circuit of reset and sleep because okay after you reset this system or we can say uh, like uh, uh, help of the jumper wire you showed these two terminals then your uh, like uh, your control is activate okay otherwise your act, uh, control is not activate and motor not able to rotate okay okay after do same connection now let's come on the programming okay now come the programming okay and you see uh, its programming is same as like uh, i already uploaded one video about the stepper motor now i show you okay uh, come your youtube and enter a live stepper motor okay in this video i already uh, tell about everything step to step okay in the same uh, we are using in the present programming okay present project programming okay same okay first you need to uh, visit on this video okay after that come on uh, present video okay 
because the programming is same have a little modification now i tell you what's a modification on this project and uh, this project i'm giving on the description you can easy to download okay and uh, in this video you uh, please try to understand what's uh, going on here okay now all programming is same same to same okay but the lead because uh, it's also a step motor okay now uh, you see have a little modification little modification is uh, first this okay uh, in this video uh, we are using a two pins three and four pins okay three is for steps four is for direction okay and uh, this one is like we need to choose uh, this specification like control method we are using two wire one pulse and direction okay choose this okay this is a two modification you need to do in this video in this project okay after that all programming is same as like on the uh, this video uh, this one video okay uh, in this video i'm uh, talking about step to step you can easy to understand about the programming okay okay now let's test what's going on here okay now after you change these two pins and this one then you need to uh, choose your com okay now i choose com, com number three okay okay and press to run button okay and you see arduino have blink one uh, one led you need to refresh press this button okay now let's uh, click to manual okay but it's not working why uh, let's see okay yes you need to enter a value step per pins okay and here also you need to enter step pins and this is step to move how many steps move when i enter a 90 here also i am entering 90 okay then uh, click to run okay and you need to refresh okay you see okay but oh yeah we need to uh, modify here stepper pins also i am using a two pins then enter here okay then click to run okay then click to refresh yes okay let's what you do please uh, first click to manual button and you see it's move manually you see it's move 90 degree okay when you change the direction like if i enter here 180 it's a manual m means manual then i am using a manual switch okay when i enter manual 180 then i click to enter you see it's when i uh, press a one time it's move or complete uh, cycle 180 degree see 180 if i enter here like 30 degree means 30 then you see it's move only 30 0 to 30 you see 30 you can easy to control as per your comment if i enter here 360 and when i press 360 and you see it's complete one cycle on 360 after that stop it you see okay when i enter here 90 then uh, sorry uh, i'm enter here 180 then click to manual and you see 180 degree okay this is our like manual okay now let's come on the auto and how it's works uh, understanding this video okay uh when i press to the auto switch okay we need to refresh press to refresh button and you see it's working in continuity operation okay and manual is for one pulse okay if you need to close this how you can close this first turn off auto switch click to stop need to refresh then click to manual you see okay it's amazing okay it's very helpful to make robotic projects okay everything you need to have robot or a machine for industry purpose you can use this type of motors in a small project okay this is type of motor and it's a very high torque okay this is very high torque you can easy to do any project okay okay so, uh, it's video is complete okay in this uh, i already told you first to visit this video because in this video i am telling about every steps about the this programming every steps in this programming okay in this video we uh, need to modification this and this one only okay otherwise it's same okay in this uh, this program is i am giving the description you can easy to download okay and uh, you can easy to do uh, r and d as per recommend like change this one this one and this one 
uh, okay you can do R&D also okay in the next video I am telling about how you can control the direction of this motor okay because in this motor we not um, focus on the uh, like direction it's only rotate on the one direction okay okay that's why let's come on the next video for uh, how we can control the direction motor of NEMA 17 okay guys and thank you so much guys if you like this video please like and share with your friends and thank you so much guys